I'm Lavina V. Khanna. I've been this in fitness line since more than 20 years now. The first class I took when I was in my 10th standard. Uh, I started uh, learning from NIA, National Institute of Aerobics. Then I went to Reebok training, then the Zumba training came in. Then every time I travel abroad, I try to do a course. I did my uh, trampoline workshops. I did my pole dancing. Right now I'm uh, focusing on aerial yoga. Plus I do a workout which is called Tabata workout. People who are having less time when they're working so they can cover up the one hour workout in a 40 minutes uh, class. So different workouts every time. See first uh, we would do a different, you know, every time like when I started teaching the methods were different. Now the methods are different now. Keeps changing with time, new inventions, new stuff. I do a step workout where uh, we have blocks. Sometimes in, I change the blocks, I, I try to do Bollywood in it. So it's all about how you move your class. Sometimes there are new students in the class. Then you have to modify the class according to the students in the class. They will not be able to do a high intensity class. So we go according to the students. Then I do a Pilates class which we do with the magic rings. Then I have a class called um, pole dancing. Pole fitness because dancing, pole dancing is like a taboo over here. Uh, women don't want to go to a pole dancing class here, so uh, we term it as uh, pole fitness and uh, people like it because it works your um, sensuality and you know it gets your oomph out, so there are a lot of things in that class. There is this class called trampoline uh, power jump, it's very soft on your knees, soft on your back, people having problems with knees, back should be doing that class. Then I do a class called Zumba. Like Zumba has become a big rage. Every uh, routine of uh, Zumba is different. All songs every month keep changing. It's like high intensity with like a lot of Zumba moves, uh, merengue and uh, reggaeton and you know different stuff. I add Bollywood into it also because we need to be updated with the Bollywood songs also. Then I do a class called uh, Yoga Jam. Now yoga jam, there are different types of yoga which I try to do. I do tribal yoga, I do uh, Tibetan yoga, then I do power yoga, then I do um, only asanas or I might just get Bikrams all, uh, uh, you know, uh, 26 positions to be mastered. So different types of class. I don't repeat any class every time. I just tell my students do a variation of class. Do not stick to one exercise. Because when so much fitness has, uh, you know, has such a vast range of choices, you cannot stick to only one class. You need to do different classes. Then I do a class called um, only apps. So we work out only apps for half an hour. It's called the app jam. So that's all different. I see to it that the beginner feels comfortable in the class. And uh, the level which we might do may be higher but I tell them to just go slow till they reach our level. So they go slow, they know their pace and they catch up to the pace later on. So I tell them not to be in a hurry, just be, even if you do 50% of the class when you initially come for class that is okay. You don't have to hurry up and you know be to our level. You know what, um, I was fat in school okay and uh, I started working out at Talwarkas. That time only Talwarkas used to be there and uh, then uh, I was pretty good at exercising and stuff. I lost my weight and and uh, the main head she asked me could you want to take classes there because you are pretty good at it. So from that time like I've been motivated. So I never thought I'm like a graduate okay. I never thought I would go into this line. So every time I see, like I hear music, I go for all the festivals around this world, like at least around India, I go and uh, listen to music, try to understand music, what is happening, like the new rage is the EDM, so we have to move on with time, you cannot keep stuck, stuck up to like one type of music and uh, that's all keeps me motivating.